Hey, Stavi. Love the show. Love what you do. Thanks, I got a pal. question. Over the past couple of years, I have been more and more suspecting I might be autistic. Hell yeah. Now, the reason I say this, because I remember when I was a kid, I mean, I'd do the excited hand flapping thing Hell and all yes. that. And I know my two brothers, they're older brothers, I think they have Asperger's or something. They're kind of screwy. <laughs> but what I want to know is at 23 years old, I'm a full-grown adult. I got a wife, two kids, decent nice job. Man. Is it worth going in and finding out? Now, my mother's told me specifically she would not have me tested because she wanted to pretend she had at least one normal child. <laughs> now, I can play along with that. What? And pretend I'm fine. I don't think it's affecting me personally or anything. What's your advice? Thank you. Okay. Uh, here's my... Uh, the fact that you don't pick up on how emotionally fucked up that is <laughs> me, yeah. means you're autistic. The fact that... Yeah. The fact, uh, yeah. 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 The fact oh, that you God. just took that thing from your mom. Yeah. Yeah. Value yeah. Oh, like, that makes sense. Okay. Yeah. No well, problem, mom. Yeah. I'm going to go alphabetize my Lego sets. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I mean, is it worth finding out? That's the thing. It's like, yeah, this guy is who he is, right? Like, whatever. Like, matter. actually, just now, um, uh, fuck, who was it? Tony Snell, an NBA player. Sorry, guys. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Oh, yeah, you know? basketball Oh, basketball guy. guy. Yeah, All right, thank God. Guys. There we go. <sighs> okay. <laughs> yeah. yeah, Snell just got, his son was born, and they put, they, the son, they tested his son for autism, and he had uh -huh. it. And then they tested Tony Snell for autism, and he had it. Oh, my God. And he was like, I always... You think he got it from the son? Yeah, dude, his son was a carrier. His son, his son bit him on the neck. <laughs> <laughs> what did you do? And they're like, Tony, no! Tony, no! <laughs> yeah, we really should still be masking. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it is airborne. Yeah. <laughs> his wife's crying. <laughs> um... So, uh, yeah, dude, I mean, look, your mom, maybe your mom, your mom is either a dumb bitch or also autistic. I don't know. Like, who says that kind of shit where it's like, I wanted at least one normal kid. So I'm not testing. Yeah, I'm not. That's, that's, that's the other thing. That's like, it doesn't make him not. Yeah. Right. Just because you don't know. Yeah. Um, Schrodinger's autism. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. You're both, yeah, right now you're both autistic and not autistic at the same time, pal. Um, but look, you... It's up to you, really. First, I would say, don't. It doesn't matter what your mom wants. Let's let's start there. Mm. That's kind of a wild thing for her to do. I guess you're the youngest one, and the first two had Aspergers, and she's like, "All right, well, he's all right. He's not. <laughs> it's not totally obvious. So yeah. I'm just. I just don't want to know." It's up to you. You want to know if you're autistic? Take the test. I say. I say just take it because it's information, you know, um, and it's whatever. But it's really. If you feel like you want to know, great, but you got a kid, you got a job, you got a wife, all that stuff, you don't, you know, you don't, I'm going to say, my guess is autistic just because he, like, he sounds like a, a guy who's settling the old west. Like, he talks so proper <laughs> I know. and nice, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, yeah. It, it does sound like he yeah. is from, did this voicemail may have come, like, 50 years ago. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It, well, I reckon... Like, when he's talking about his brothers having Aspergers, too, he's like, uh, you know, they were uh, kind of screwy. Rather yeah, screwy, right. fellas. He's a little yeah. touched. Uh, yeah, right. yeah, yeah. That's right. Um, so, yeah, dude, I'm going to guess you got a little sprinkling of something. But it is ultimately who gives a fuck because everyone just is. We all have a bunch of shit wrong with us, and it affects the way you, you behave. And it's just like, that's what makes everybody a little bit different. So who, who cares? You're clearly functioning and all this kind of shit. Um, and, you know, the, the, hand, the occasional hand flap every once in a while, who cares? Um, but yeah, you're good. I don't, you know, I'd like to know, I'd like to test myself for a bunch. Like my therapist said, I, I probably have some kind of learning disability. And I, I just don't know. I definitely don't have autism or because I, I didn't zero in on that and try and figure it out. Like doing the research I try I was like how to get test if you have a disability and I just got bored and didn't never found out <laughs> so that's probably part of the disability but I'd like to know but I just if anybody here knows how to test for that let us know but it ultimately doesn't fucking matter no you know what yeah I, mean? I don't know Eldis you have anything wrong with you man 
I've I've like I've I've been the past been like I wonder if I'm like at least a little autistic too. <laughs> you're <laughs> little not. Things here there. No, you're not. It I'm, is very like in right now. It is. Oh, it yeah. is. It's it's, it's like, so in that it's bordering on hack. Yeah. Like I don't. I actually, in fact, it's almost. I think I'm ready to put the the hack yeah. stamp yeah. on it. Yeah. yeah. It's because it's gotten to the point. You know, I'm in. I I like to go and I like to do comedy everywhere. And I've been. I I was doing a lot of clubs when I was in L. A. And it's gotten to like, it's gotten to like, you know, tight shirt trucker hat guys are talking about being autistic <laughs> yeah, and like, and like bitches that were on like Chelsea lately. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, like, yeah, like totally. they're talking about being autistic now. It started and it's like, as a thing where like on like the irony pilled like Twitter, yes, yes. like people would be like, oh, I'm autistic or whatever. Yes. And then now it's just like everyone is being like. Yeah, I'm like, oh, I'm a little autistic. Totally. Yeah. It's a, yeah. this strange... You know what? Fuck these guys. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, let's fucking this... take them out. So, yeah, you're, yeah, you're a fucking hack, dude. <laughs> <laughs> what we're getting at is yeah, you're a fucking hack. Yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like in a special ed class telling them. <laughs> like, everyone is like Come claiming on. to be autistic. Yeah, dude, yeah, get new shit. Yeah, well, <laughs> Just done deeply with this autistic. Trauma porn bullshit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys fucking suck. I know it's also funny because what we think of as autistic is like, like the just a guy who you know, is just doesn't make eye. We think of young Sheldon basically, yeah. like just some nerd. We think of a nerd who's kind of abrasive, but then there's like there's a spectrum of autism where it's like these motherfuckers are very disabled. Yeah, you know, it's like yeah. no one is pretending to be that. You know, so it's right. just this. You're it. It is. It's it's weird how it has gone into the culture. Where it's it's almost it's taking the same trajectory as woke in a weird way, yeah. And mm-hmm. it will never get to the height like, you know, Republicans fucking picked up woke and took it to the next level. Yeah. But it was this thing that was just Twitter, and then it right. got to like, a and word then it that got just to hacks, spiraled out of control, right. and now it's got like a political, you know, right. use for, I guess. But autism, I don't, I don't see that happening. I don't see, <laughs> I don't see Ron DeSantis be awesome. being like, we gotta stop the woke, the autism. <laughs> we gotta, everyone's being, they're yeah. turning our kids autistic. Hollywood's too autistic. Hollywood's too <laughs> autistic <laughs> these days. <laughs> Barbie's an autistic yeah. movie. <laughs> autistic Little Mermaid. I bet you, you know, I bet you there is like, there's probably an autistic, that's the other thing, all we think about is nerds, there's probably like a hot autistic lady who like loves to dress, like is very particular about her dresses and shit like that. Yeah. You know, let's get some hot autistic yeah. people out here, you know? Yeah. I'm tired of these fucking yeah. nerds. Yeah. We're the autistic, we're the bitches autistic for sucking dick, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Who's autistic for that? Yeah, Give her my email address. Yeah, maybe a girl that fixates on like her body and yeah, stuff. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's like Who's that a- one move that Jamie Foxx movie with the violin, but his skill is sucking dick. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Robert Downey Jr. is looking Some for Some homeless head. guy just air sucking dick. <laughs> and it's like, oh my god, his you technique is unbelievable. <laughs> He's sucking dick on a street corner. People are throwing dollar. But they're like, oh my god, it's- I've never seen anyone throat so effortless. <laughs> and then Robert Downey Jr. hires him to suck dick. And yeah. I guess I don't. I've never seen the movie, but I guess he may, puts him in the. He does a concert. Of oh dick. yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> they rent out concert. Carnegie Hall, yeah. and he's in a fucking tuxedo with tails, <laughs> and he's but knee pads on, and he starts sucking dick. That'd be great. We got a really good idea there. Yeah. <laughs>